do on this uh, holiday weekend. Hope everyone had a wonderful Thanksgiving and uh, just really pleased that you took the time out of your busy, busy schedule to be here with us uh, today. One second, I'm going to mute us out. There we go. We're good now. But uh, in any case, I think you're going to really enjoy this presentation that you're about to see here. We've got a full house here on this uh, holiday weekend, and we're real pleased to be able to share with it. We're going to move pretty fast here. Uh, there's going to be a lot of information coming at you pretty quick, but you're going to start to see something that we're very proud of, and it's a business, and it's all about innovation and an industry that we love and we appreciate. Uh, but someone obviously cared a lot about you, too, because they're sharing this opportunity for you to take a look at this for yourself. Uh, we're very much in a uh, formulation stage. In other words, it's very much a, a just kind of a select group of people that are being invited here to take a look at what we're doing here at Minerva Worldwide. And I think you're going to really, again, enjoy it. You see on your screen the genesis, and you see Henry Ford here. You know, Henry Ford represented innovation not just because he built an automobile. There were several automobiles being built uh, during that era. But what Henry did was he mass-produced the automobile and made it affordable to the masses. And that was the innovation. It was really the uh, a major turn in time. And that's what we're doing here, too, with the industry that we're in. And let me share some insights with you. We're basically creating what's called a fusion model. And we are fusing two very successful industries together to create a hybrid. The first is online community marketing. We're all familiar with the big internet brands today. We spend a lot of time on the internet shopping for information. We uh, we purchase, obviously, on the Internet. We do a lot of research on the Internet. We communicate with others. We, we're part of community, communities with others as well. The challenge with those business models is that they're very expensive to start and to ramp up. You see companies spending hundreds of millions of dollars and, and sustaining huge losses for very prolonged periods of time trying to ramp up those types of models. Think of Amazon.com just for a minute. It took many, many years, almost a decade, before they turned to profit. A lot of investment went into that business. But now you look at it, what they're seeing and what so other many other companies on the Internet are seeing is unlimited growth. And that's the beauty of that business model. Is the, the growth model is completely unlimited. Then we look at network marketing, an industry that we're all very familiar with, very passionate about. It has a reduced cost ramp up associated with it. it. You can have very, very fast growth, providing you have the right pieces of the business model put together properly, but it has limited growth potential. There's always that ceiling, and there's a high risk associated with it as well. But it's still a very successful industry. And when you fuse the two industries together, you create a new paradigm. You have reduced cost ramp up, a reduced risk model, and you have a model that has unlimited growth potential. And that's what we're excited about. That's what we're excited about sharing with you here today. Now, this has never been done before, and we're sharing with you what is completely a, a new paradigm. So we're all familiar with word-of-mouth marketing, network marketing. Many of us have spent many, many years in the industry. It's a, if you want to build community, there's no better industry to build community with. Billion-dollar brands are built in this industry, and many of you on the line have helped build some of those billion dollar brands. It's a very successful industry, very profitable industry around the globe today. So much so that it tracks some pretty heavy hitters as well. People like Warren Buffett, for example, uh, who owns the Pampered Chef. Uh, he called it one of the best investments that he ever made. Richard Branson involved in the industry. These guys get involved with the industry because they know it's a great social business model. It's a great way to create wealth. But there's limitations to the industry. And that's what we want to look at here first here today. One of the things that we did as co-founders, getting together and spending collectively about 180 years in the industry, is saying, what are the challenges that we faced over the course of our careers in the industry? What are the limitations that we'd have to overcome if we want to innovate? Innovate is the key word here in the industry. And so I want to take you through those. And remember that as I take you through these, very much have a love and a passion and appreciation for the industry. We're just simply putting out some of the challenges that we've faced along the way, the same challenges that you faced, and the challenges that we wanted to overcome in order to innovate here. So the first flaw, we call them the seven deadly flaws, if you will. And the first flaw is that generally we're tied to some type of a product. And many times that product, we're, we're kind of pushing the envelope of legal compliance with it because of the type of stories that are being told. Sometimes it doesn't deliver just as promised and many times the reorders just are too small to retain any type of a retail customer base or any type of a good solid residual income from it 
And unfortunately, as we've seen so many times, the product can become a toxic asset. Uh, someone might get sick, the FDA challenges it, or maybe the FTC comes in and does not like the way that it's being sold. The key is, is that you're being tied to the product. The other challenge is that when a product does become successful, guess what? It doesn't take long today, particularly with the internet, for that product to get knocked off. So very shortly you start to see on retail shelves and across the internet knockoffs of that very successful product for a quarter for half the price. Nothing worse than building a large organization only to find out that someone's knocked off your, your entire product line. The other challenge, the other flaw that we face in the industry, and we see this so many times in the industry, is that inexperience, uh, many times unscrupulous people come into the industry, uh, they know that it's a very profitable business, they know that they can make a lot of money with it, their primary motivation is greed, not helping other people. And if you haven't built from the ground up in this industry, then you don't know what it's like to be a distributor, you don't know what it's like to be in the field, and you really have to have that experience before you can come in and run a company in this industry. The other flaw that we face is that Companies have a tough time expanding internationally, and you can only grow so much. Remember, limited growth was the model that we looked at on the direct selling side of things. And in order to grow internationally, you have to uh, comply with the various laws that take place around the globe as you're expanding. And that's a big challenge. It costs a lot of money, and it takes a lot of time. So international expansion can be very, very slow, very complicated. The other challenge we face is that we're relying, for the most part, on non-professionals to sell, all of us. Think about it for a minute. You know, we bring someone on as a product user, a, a solid retail customer, and then we're required to try and convert them into a business opportunity. They didn't sign up for a business opportunity, they signed up for a product. This is not what's called an organic upsell. Let me explain an organic upsell, a very natural selling process. You walk into your favorite store to buy a suit, the salesperson sells you the suit, they come back, what, in the next few minutes with a great looking shirt that goes with that suit and they tell you how nice that, that shirt's going to look with that suit and then they come back a few minutes later with a tie and they explain how that tie is going to look so great with that suit and that shirt. That's an organic, very natural upsell. And so, you know, there's, it's, there's, that's why you see there's so much friction in the process of trying to convert people from a customer to a distributor. It's just not a natural process. The other challenge we face is that we work hard, we fill up a large hotel room with say 100 or 200 people, and on a really good day we might see 30% that join us either from a, as a product user or someone that wants to become a part of the business opportunity as well. But what happens to the 70 that say no? We don't have the time or the means to follow up to find out what happened to that 70%. So we basically lose them. We should be capturing at least 30% or more of the people uh, that attended, but it just doesn't happen. The other challenge that we face is that when product sales start falling off, and think of that original model, go back to number one again, companies tied to a product, what generally happens? The product sales start falling off. So the very natural reaction to that is to do what? It's to create a line extension. And when you do that, what are you doing? You're just reintroducing all the risks that you faced in flaw number one of launching a new product. And the last of the seven deadly flaws is that we don't adequately share in the success of a company. When you think about it, when you really look at it closely, we're tied to a static and linear compensation plan. And many people on this line have helped build billion dollar brands. They've been tied to that plan. And with the model that uh, we're proposing here, it's very, very different because people, they need to be tied to the success of the company on an immediate and an ongoing sliding scale on a global basis. Now I want you to really imagine, this is where we're going to start to look at innovation in the industry. This is when you're going to start to see and really understand what we've been doing here. I want you to imagine a minute a company that's associated with no product is never going to ask you to sell a product, yet you profit from the sale of hundreds of products. Imagine a company in a process, a selling process that doesn't involve that two-step conversion process, that process that has so much friction. Even someone who's busy in a primary career on a very part-time basis without making a single phone call, with having, without having a, a single uh, conversation with anyone or attending a single meeting can be very, very successful in the business. Imagine a company where famous physicians and health professionals and celebrities, they want to join. They want to be a part. They want to take an active role in promoting the company 
and their association. And imagine a company which aggressively captures 30% of your lost leads and sells 30% of your customers. And imagine a company that changes and grows every single day. You expect change. You expect growth. And this company never runs out of steam. We don't tangle with the FDA. We don't tangle with the FTC. We don't get bad press. And imagine a company that people are just very, very proud to be associated with. They're sharing their, their discovery with others. They're recommending their friends and family. Everybody wants to participate at some level. And imagine a company that's rewarding you for participation in the growth on a global scale and doing it no, hard, no matter how large or small your particular contribution is in that growth. I want you to meet the future in innovation, Minerva Place. In case you're wondering how we got the name, Minerva, with her pet owl, is a classic symbol for wisdom, healing, and medicine. And if you look closely at our logo there, you're going to see the face of an owl. The face of an owl is designed, if you look at it, it's very much the shape of a heart. And our logo is very simply an owl that's winking at you. And that owl stands for wisdom. It's our goal to build a premier online destination. One of the top destinations in the world. And in our vertical, diet, health, yeah, we're going to do it in very quick fashion. And I'm going to show you how. So what's a premier online destination? Let's play word association real quick. There's lots of destinations on the internet, but what's a premier online destination? When you think books, you're most likely going to think Amazon.com. When you think travel, you're probably thinking Expedia, Travelocity. When you think medical, WebMD, top of mind, premier destination, classifieds, Craigslist, diet, health, and beauty, there is none. There's dozens of sites, but there is not one single premier online destination. Think about it, 230, almost $240 billion a year industry with no primary online destination. That is a huge opportunity for all of us. And we estimate working with all of you in the first couple of years inside of it, we're going to become the number one ranked diet site in the world. And what does that mean for all of us? Well, it means a lot of money, of course. So you're asking, well, how are we going to do this? And this is where the innovation continues. The plan is really quite simple. Minerva Place is an online community. We're providing free but very, very valuable content all about losing weight and all about diet, health, and beauty. When you take a closer look at the community, what you see is uh, just a very prestigious destination. This design, this community was designed by the best designers on the internet today. But it's content that rules the web. And just about every one of us, just about every person on this planet is turning to the internet for content and doing it on the, a daily basis, along with entertainment. And we're going to maintain our community and attract visitors with a lot of dazzling content and a lot of entertainment. And our whole theme is living smart and living beautiful. Now, it takes a lot of talent to produce the kind of content that's needed to drive a destination, a premier online destination like this. Right now, we have 75 contributing writers that are already writing and contributing content for the launch of MinervaPlace.com, which is scheduled for the first quarter of next year. Now, these are writers, these are professionals that you read about all the time. They have articles today in major, major magazines and newspapers, the New York Times, uh, Shape Fitness, Red Book, Rolling Stone. These are people you see on the CBS News, ABC, CNN. These are people that you read about just about everywhere. They're the best of the best writers today around the globe. And they're participating and very excited about Minerva Place and what it represents and very eager to participate and contribute content to MinervaPlace.com. Again, people that names that you recognize, names that uh, are brands all in themselves today that are participating here at MinervaPlace.com. And the content they're producing for all of us is excellent content. And that content is going to populate this entire website, which is going to be replicated for you. Now, our plan starts out with a beautiful website, of course, if you just saw. But there's something very unique about this website because one of the many attractions, and there's many attractions here, one of the many is a full-length video about losing weight. Now, this video, if someone watches it, they're guaranteed to lose weight. This is the state-of-the-art weight management plan. It's been created by 
a very famous doctor, a doctor with two PhDs. This is an incredible presentation that people will watch, and it's completely free to watch. What happens when a first-time visitor comes to your MinervaPlace.com website is the background of the website is shaded out, but the video stands out. It's very prominent. Now, ever since we've been developing this business model, we wanted someone to invite and welcome your guest to this website, but we wanted someone very special. We wanted a celebrity. We wanted someone that's in the now. We wanted specifically a person who is fit, who is smart, who is beautiful. We wanted someone that has a family. We wanted someone that lives a healthy lifestyle and has a very successful career. And we went out on a search for this individual, and we wanted someone that was in prime time network television today. And we came up and ended up uh, contracting with uh, just a, an incredible individual, an actress, a dancer, a model, a TV star. Her name is Brooke Burke. Brooke Burke, you're going to recognize as a co-host with Dancing of the Stars. She's just the perfect fit for Minerva Place. She's a devoted mother of four children. She's committed to a healthy lifestyle, has a very successful career. She lives a fit, smart, beautiful life. And she is going to welcome every new visitor to your Minerva Place website. She is going to invite them to watch the weight loss video. She is also going to invite them to become a member, a paying member of MinervaPlace.com. This is a very powerful introduction and welcome to this website. We're very pleased to make that announcement. Now, keep in mind that this, this video is a major giveaway even on the Internet. DVDs and e-books sell for big bucks on the Internet right now, uh, all related to weight loss. All we're asking for is a name and an email address. That's all we ask for when someone comes to the website. And as we all know, that email address, it's pure gold. Now, what happens when we have this email address? And this is where the plan really starts to kick in, and you're going to recognize what's happening here. But once someone submits their name and their email address, they become a community member, and they have access to a lot of premium content and many of the benefits. They also have an opportunity to win $10,000 for the best weight loss story. And we're engaging with these people on your behalf every single day. We know the video works because our chief marketing officer, who I'm going to introduce you to here in just a couple of minutes, he's consulted to and he's provided creative services for a lot of the major uh, diet companies. He's worked in the vertical for over 30 years. And he's brought in award-winning writers and producers, top Hollywood talent, to produce these videos. Now, chances are you're here because you've already seen one of the productions we're putting out, which is the pre-enrollment video. That's just the beginning of a very web-centric experience that's going to take place here at MinervaPlace.com. So how are we all making money? That's a great question. I'm going to show you how we're monetizing the community and how you can participate. Our target market is women, 24 to 49. Now, we have something for everyone, women of every age, men of every age, but we also have a target demographic. And so you may ask, well, why? Why that target? Well, that it's real simple. The advertisers want to reach this target demographic in a major way. It's called the power of the purse. And they're willing to pay the big bucks in order to reach this target demographic. And as we build our community and build our content around this target demographic, we're going to be attracting these advertisers. And the advertising revenues that we generate through MinervaPlace.com, we are going to share with you. Our business model is very unique. I'm going to show you a comparison real quick of what you generally see on the Internet. Generally what you see with publishers, let's say for example WebMD, is they generate their revenue a couple of different ways. One is through display advertising, very common as you see here, like the Maybelline ad that's there on our website. And the other way is through cost per acquisition advertising that's taking place on the website as well. Now these properties, these websites do very, very well. Many of them are billion dollar brands as we all know. And they're generating their revenues primarily through those sources. We introduce additional revenue centers, additional revenue centers which you participate in. For example, our private label products, our micro store concept, which I'll introduce you to here in a second. Very exciting concept. Our business opportunity and our premium memberships. Advertisers pay a increased rate to be involved in our newsletter, Muse News. It's a considerably higher rate, which again, we're sharing with our members through our compensation structure. And even though a membership is free, the initial membership, the basic membership, 
we're constantly offering people the opportunity to upgrade to become a Premier member for $19.95. Now remember, this is an introduction and an invitation that starts with the introduction video when someone comes to your website with Brooke Burke. Now someone, when they upgrade to a premium member for $19.95, they have access to a lot of special features on the website, discounts, cash rewards. They have a chance to win $1,000 for sharing their weight loss story. They still have a chance to be involved in the $10,000 contest for the best weight loss story. They're doing some other things, too, that I'm going to share with you real quickly. But once someone becomes a premier member, they're given their own version of the Minerva Place online community. We do that so that we can track all the transactions that are taking place on this website back to you. Now, once we have an email address and once someone becomes even a premier member, which is a very natural upgrade, and remember, we're doing this for you. This isn't something that you are selling. We're doing this for you. And we're constantly providing opportunities for people to purchase additional products. We're learning about their buying habits. We know what type of products they're interested in. We know what kind of reading they're interested in. So we're upselling consistently. We make it very easy for all of our members to share Minerva Place because we're connected, and I'm going to show you in just a second, to all the social media tools. At the click of a mouse, you can share your Minerva Place website with hundreds, even thousands of people. And remember, because we have that email address, whether it's someone that simply just watched the movie or someone that also became a premier member for $19.95, we're constantly staying in touch with that person. We're sending them success stories. We're enticing them to read articles and to watch videos that we have on MinervaPlace.com, all involving them in the community and all at the same time exposing them to related products that are available through Minerva Place in the diet, health, and beauty categories, products of which we pay you cash rewards on. Every new member that gets started with Minerva Place is going to feel very, very good about their association because a percent of every new membership is going to help fight childhood obesity. And childhood obesity is very much our cause and our mission. But it gets even better. As I mentioned earlier, the micro stores are really an exciting part of the opportunity. Here's an opportunity for you to earn even additional commissions, additional cash rewards. Having a micro store within Minerva Place itself. And we help people drive traffic to this website through Traffic Academy. Traffic Academy is free to all of our members. We simply want to help people be successful, drive traffic to the Minerva Place website through Traffic Academy, learning how to turn your personal website, you really can turn it into a cash cow and that's our goal. This is a win-win for everyone as you can see. This is an opportunity that people are very happy to share with everyone that they know. Why? Because they're not trying to sell anything to anybody. They're not trying to sell a product. They're not trying to sell someone on a business opportunity. They're simply sharing content. They're sharing a destination, a premier online destination for content on living smart and living beautiful. And Minerva never sleeps. As you're referring traffic, Minerva is selling products for members, upselling uh, memberships for members. We're converting visitors into members. We're upselling members into the elite membership. We're upselling and training members 24-7. And we've also overcome all the seven flaws that we just went through. So membership here translates into profits for everyone that's involved. And we have some pretty conservative but pretty exciting growth figures here that we want to share with you as well. We think that by the end of our first year, we'll be driving about 8% of the traffic that WebMD sees today. That's significant. That's a lot of traffic coming to a destination. We believe that we'll have about 6 million people reading our newsletter on a daily basis. And thanks to the help of you helping us build this brand, we expect to be number four in the top 10 health-related sites, but greatly more profitable. By the end of our second year, we think we're going to be at about 32% of what WebMD sees today, which is about 28 million unique visitors on a monthly basis. We think we're going to be ranked number two or number three in the top 10 health-related sites. We're going to be driving three times the revenue. Many of the products that you're going to see on MinervaPlace.com are supported by uh, key patents that are issued and, and part of MinervaPlace.com. These patents are good and uh, 10 countries as well as we expand the company internationally, uh, globally. Again, this is an unlimited growth model. And as you can see here, we already have our target countries. Uh, we first are expanding into Australia and Southeast Asia, then on to Canada and Mexico, 
and onward. You can see that's our plan in the first 18 months for international expansion. Now, what's so nice about our business model is that we don't face all the compliance challenges that other companies face when they're trying to expand internationally. Because as we expand internationally, we're simply populating MinervaPlace.com in that country with all the local products that are available and approved in that country. To handle our international expansion and help oversight of it, we've brought on a law firm, Jones Waldo. Jones Waldo is the most prestigious firm in this country for handling direct selling companies. They've been around since 1875. They're assisting us with all of our regulatory compliance here in the United States. They'll be assisting us with that in each country that we expand into as well. And our objective is to become number one in 36 months. We fully anticipate in our first few months, fourth month, we'll be surpassing brands such as Nutrisystem and South Beach Diet. We know that we'll be attracting about a million unique visitors a month by month six. And we expect by month six when we launch our mobile platforms, we'll see about 5,000 people a day uh, downloading from iPhones, Androids, Blackberries. It's going to be some significant growth very, very quickly. Now, this is a big project, as you're seeing. This is a very aggressive project, as you're seeing. And make no mistake, we're here to build a billion-dollar brand. You're looking at and have an opportunity to be at the ground floor of a major, major brand that's going to build globally. It takes a big team of people to pull this off. And it's really the team of people that we're so proud of here. We call it the dream team. There's 180 years plus experience here, uh, both in network marketing as independent distributors starting from the ground up, owning companies in the industries, working as master distributors, also a lot of experience in weight loss systems, e-commerce, publishing, social media, brand marketing, and advertising, all a part of this business concept. I want to introduce you to some of the people behind this company, the co-founders to start with. Peter Bailoff, our chief marketing officer. Peter's a genius. Much of this concept originated from Peter. He's led the marketing and advertising efforts of a lot of America's top corporations, as you see here on the slide. He also holds numerous records in the direct marketing industry. He's helped launch six companies in this industry that's realized over $100 million in sales inside of their first 24 months. He also has written a lot of screenplays. Somehow in his part-time, uh, he's been able to do that. He's won the very prestigious Norman Lear Award and the very prestigious Writers Foundation Award for screenwriting. He's a very talented man. Much of the video content that you're seeing, the oversight of the content that's coming together from Minerva Place, the designs, and so forth, much of that is directed by Peter Bailoff in his experience 30 years in the diet, health, and beauty vertical. John Gustin is our chief executive officer. A uh, great gentleman. Uh, he helped build one of the fastest growth companies ever in this industry, one of the fastest growth companies in the country at the time, United Sciences of America, went on to build his own company, uh, very, very successful, also as a consultant in the industry to the top brands in our industry as well. He's also the co-inventor of something called the Smart Index, which is a, just an ingenious model for ranking foods uh, so we understand better their health benefits. Jimmy Cossard. Jimmy Cossard is also a co-founder. Jimmy Cossard is the vice president of sales. He's going to lead the field. If you want to build community, you want Jimmy Cossard on your team. He is just an incredible man and uh, proof's in the pudding. He's built an organization of over 200,000 people worldwide. And his team uh, produced close to three quarters of a billion dollars in sales. You can pick up practically any book, uh, any magazine in the industry. You're going to read about Jimmy Cossard. We're very pleased that he's a co-founder here and helping to lead the field for Minerva Place. Larry Thompson's an advisor, helped co-found Herbalife, along with Mark Hughes. Many of you are familiar with that brand. Today it's about a $3 billion company. Uh, the Wall Street Journal calls Larry the architect of wealth building. Ted Charchuk's the chief operating officer. Ted is, has vast experience in growing companies internationally. Uh, he has also built his own organization, over 100,000 people uh, internationally as well. And myself, uh, spending 22 years now in this industry, loving every moment of it, coming from a completely different industry in my first half of my career, but loving the freedom and the independence that this industry provides and, and uh, have a deep desire to share it with others. On our team, Patrick Ferlonzo. Patrick's our Vice President of Advertising and Media. Very interesting guy. Um, Patrick is a, one of these people, when other kids were watching cartoons, Patrick was programming software. By the time he was in junior high, he was buying and selling domain names, making a lot of money in junior high. Then by the time he was 20, he had made his first fortune on the Internet. 
Patrick is someone who is very much in demand by major internet companies. They want him because he knows how to convert offers on the internet. He understands split testing procedures and he can, he can take conversion rates and increase them, double them, triple them to compare to what companies do today. Brilliant online marketer, the best in the industry and he's heading our, all of our advertising and media. So as you're starting to see transactions taking place on your MinervaPlaceWebsite.com, it's Patrick and his team behind the scenes that are making that happen. Mike Lansbury is our editor in chief. Uh, Lansbury is a big name, as you know, in the entertainment world. Uh, Mike is uh, 20 years a senior network studio executive. He's been with NBC, Mary Tyler Moore, uh, Universal. He was one of the original architects for Fox Broadcasting. He had a complete oversight of, of all of their writing staffs and programming content. Well, guess what he's doing here at Minerva Place? The 75 writers that are currently contributing content to Minerva Place, Mike's overseeing that activity completely. So all of the content that you see coming together from MinervaPlace.com for our launch, it's Mike Lansbury behind all of that, making sure that that happens, and no one better to do it. He's the best in the business in the world. Lonnie Cover. Lonnie is our chief technical officer. Lonnie brings 14 years of experience with IBM to Minerva. In other words, he brings precision to Minerva Place. Everything that we need, that we need to do, our rollout, our activities long term, they need to be handled with absolute precision, and Lonnie's the man overseeing that. And our most recent addition to the executive staff is Mark Wilson. You may have seen this press release, and if not, uh, we're going to point you towards it later, but he, Mark's come on as our chief financial officer, uh, Bachelor of Science in Economics from BYU and his executive master's uh, from the University of Washington, uh, very successful entrepreneur uh, for many, many years. That success came from his earlier years. Mark was also one of the top five scholar athletes in our uh, nation. Uh, uh, he was selected by the NCAA for his postgraduate scholarship and uh, went on to play professional football as quarterback for the Oakland Raiders. Uh, you may remember him in the 1980s. He played for 10 seasons. He participated in two, two Super Bowl championship seasons as well. And uh, you can see on this pre press release, uh, Mark being quoted as saying, uh, quote, being part of Minerva feels a lot like I remember it felt on those Raiders Super Bowl teams. And boy, I'll tell you, it's be great. It's just great working with Mark. It's great having him on the team and uh, really rounds out our team here at MinervaPlace.com as well. As you can see, we're doing something very innovative to begin with, which is pre-enrollment. And that's probably how you found us and probably why you're here right now today. Pre-enrollment is up and running just the last few days. We're going to run pre-enrollment up until the point that we officially launch MinervaPlace.com. Now, what does this mean for you? This means that you have an opportunity to begin to pre-build a team so that when MinervaPlace.com launches, you're not just starting the day that it launches. You've already started. You have a team that's already engaging, and you have traffic. And it could be an awful lot of traffic to a whole organization of websites where transactions are taking place. Our goal, to build a pre-enrollment of more than 100,000 registrants. And we're already well on our way. We have a share center. When you pre-enroll, the share center is going to allow you, at the touch of a button, to share your discovery with 1, 10, 1,000, or even 5,000 or 10,000 people at the click of a button. All you have to do is log into that share center and just navigate through it. It's very simple. We give you a step one, step two, step three, and you can share with all the social medias. You can share via email, and very shortly you're going to be able to share through uh, a ticketing system that we're placing as well. Also, you'll notice when you log into your share center, uh, you want to make sure that you look down at the bottom of the share center because there you're going to see our news archives as well. So you can stay completely up to date on what's happening. Of course, we're going to be sending out emails to keep you up to date, but there's also information that's already been distributed prior to you joining us where you can go back and you can look at the archives and get a feel for just what's coming together here at Minerva Worldwide. Also there, you'll see a link in your share center down on the bottom to frequently asked questions. And I encourage you to go there and to read through the frequently asked questions because it really will help you further understand the innovation that's taking place with our business opportunity. As you can see, this is one smart business model. And we're very pleased that you have had the opportunity to see it firsthand for yourself, to discover this very, very early on. There's only a handful of people that really understand the business model and the opportunity that they have at hand right now. And you're one of those individuals. So 
our recommendation is is to just go with this and go with gusto because it's an incredible incredible opportunity there'll never be a, another opportunity like this to be associated with minerva place to be a founding member to discover it so early on uh, someone obviously really did care about you enough to refer you to this and allow you to discover this for yourself it's all about timing and positioning there's a huge opportunity for financial gain here for the right people and it's just a matter of pre-building during pre-enrollment pre-enrollment is simply sharing this concept with as many other people as you can using your pre-enrollment website and we will continue these webinars for you so that you can also invite people to the webinars so they get a closer look at just what's happening here and we'll have consistent news releases and updates and webinars to keep you informed through the pre-enrollment process there will be well over a hundred thousand people pre-enrolling and right now you're at the very top of that because we're just starting this process we're at the very very beginning so have a great holiday weekend I really appreciate everyone being here today uh, enjoy the rest of the holiday weekend but be sure to share your discovery with as many people as possible during that time as well and we will make an, an announcement very shortly as to the next date for our webinar and make sure that we invite you back thanks everyone have a great weekend